Good morning, I'm Janelle Varel with your morning digital news brief for this Tuesday, October 11th. We're following breaking news for you here this morning. A man shot dead in a driveway in Philadelphia's Winfield neighborhood. Police say they found that victim just before 12.30 this morning on the 1800 block of 52nd Street. The victim was taken to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. Police believe this shooting was targeted. And today marks exactly two weeks since a 14-year-old boy was shot and killed outside of Roxborough High School and four other teenagers were also injured in the incident. This morning, several state lawmakers will pre be presenting $500,000 to the school. That money will go towards security enhancements for the campus. And today, PennDOT hosting an event to talk about ways they're already preparing for winter. The discussion will include plans for handling snow and ice on roads and also tips to help the public to remain safe in wintry conditions. That discussion will get underway at 11 o'clock this morning in Harrisburg. Now for a look at our next weather forecast. No snow, all no, sun. Good morning, no. Andrew. Those are not live pictures, of no. course, Janelle. We are taking a look at beautiful skies today. Good morning. It's meteorologist Andrew Kozak here looking at a very gorgeous Tuesday afternoon with temperatures that will range from the low to even middle 70s. It's a mostly sunny day with a light southwesterly wind. West at times about 5 to 10. All eyes are on Thursday. No snow, but we are tracking a look at maybe a little bit of rain with our next front moving through. Thursday morning dry with increasing thickening clouds by the afternoon a few showers take a look at this between five and eight that's when the thunderstorms are rolling ahead of this next cold front a couple of those storms could be on the strong side we could be looking at gusty winds heavy rain and some lightning and thunder we are in a specific marginal outlook for day one that's going to be basically the threat for 60 mile per hour winds some brief downpours maybe some small hail we'll be tracking that and of course your seven day plan coming up a little bit later on today Andrew, thank you for that. And remember, you can always get Andrew's most up-to-date forecast and the latest stories right here on CBSPhiladelphia.com. That's the latest for your morning digital brief. I'm Janelle Burrell. Have a great Tuesday.